guys, Karen Proctor here from Powerhouse Leadership Institute with another segment of Ask the Apostle. The question for today is, should pastors go to theology school? How important is it? Thank you for sending in your question. As always, I want you to know that just like you, there's many other people out there that wants to know the answer of the same question. So thanks again for sending in your question to ask the apostle. So it's a two-party question. Should pastors go to theology school and how important is it? Well, I'm going to start out by saying theology school is not a prerequisite of becoming a pastor. According to Ephesians chapter 4 and verse 11, it is God that made the appointment for the fivefold ministry, whether you are an apostle, prophet, evangelist, pastor, or a teacher. That appointment comes from God. However, I do say that it is extremely important for those that are in ministry to have good training and also a mentor or mentoring to help them to perfect the call of God into ministry. So to say that uh, training in theology school is a prerequisite, it is not. However, it is a good thing and it is important. So I want to just uh, tell you by way of scripture, Jesus taught his 12 disciples. And after they spent time with him, he told them to do likewise, to, to give back, give back in the sense of pour pouring into people as he have poured into them. So we see that example by Jesus. We also see the apostle Paul who wrote many letters in the New Testament. He wrote a great deal of the New Testament. So Paul himself sat at the foot of one by the name of Gamil. So as we can see, mentoring and training for uh, ministry is very important. And I want to read for you Acts chapter 22, verse 3. It says, Then Paul said, I am a Jew born in Tarsus, a city in Silica, and I was brought up and educated here in Jerusalem under Gamil as his student. I was carefully trained in our Jewish law and custom. I became very zealous to honor God in everything I did, just like all of you. So Paul sat at his mentor feet. Um, then again, I want to say that the Holy Ghost is our master trainer. He teaches us revelation that we cannot even get from going to a seminary, a theology school. The Holy Ghost is our master trainer. And so John chapter 14 and verse 26 says, but when the father sends the advocate as my representative, that is the Holy Spirit, I will teach you everything and remind you of everything I have told you. Jesus said that the Holy Spirit will teach us everything and remind us of everything. He was talking to his disciples, but I'm still going to pull it into this dispensation. So the Holy Spirit is also a teacher, a trainer, John chapter 14 and verse 26. So to say, I'm not against attending a seminary or the school of theology. I do believe in proper training. Here's the thing doctors, lawyers, accountants, teachers, nurses, pilots, so on and so forth. Just about every profession goes to school to master their craft or to learn about 
what it is they want to do. And so I feel likewise, we in ministry should do the same thing. But is it a prerequisite to the call of God? No, I take you back to Ephesians chapter four and verse 11, whom God called, he already put it down in you to be what he called you to be in ministry. But then again, mentoring and training is vital it mentoring and training cannot make you become a pastor all it can do is enhance that that god has already started in you and so we even see in the book of samuel that there was a school of the prophets so even though they had the call of the prophets but they went to the school of the prophets to be uh trained by those senior prophets and the bible say iron sharper and iron so if i take two pieces of iron and rub them together they're going to sharpen each other but he say man sharpens the continent of his friend so even going to the school of the prophets even sitting at uh the feet of the teacher all of that is helping to horn the gift that God placed on the inside of you. So the school of theology and the seminary is not a requirement, but however, Paul says in 2 Timothy chapter 2 and verse 15, to study, to show our self-approval unto God. A workman need not be ashamed, but rightly dividing the word of truth. So, uh training is very important but whether it be at a school of theology or a seminary it's you don't really have to go there and i'm not against it i am all for it but just to answer your question you may have a mentor someone that has been laboring uh, in the vineyard of the Lord for years and years and years. So like Paul did, set at Gomelfi, he got what he needed. As Jesus' disciples set at, at Jesus' feet, they got what they needed as well.